welcome to PV Magazine Live. This is Christian Roseland, America's editor for PV Magazine, and we're here at the Solar Power International 2016 trade show. I'm joined by Elen Sasueta Hall from Enphase, and we're going to be talking about the new AC battery solution as part of the home energy solution. Elen, thanks so much for taking the time to talk with me. Thank you. And so, you know, the last time we talked, we talked a year ago, and you were showing off the AC battery, very exciting product. As I, as I understand, we've got some, some new developments, but let's quickly go over the AC battery again, you know, what it is and what makes it so special. All right. Well, so what the AC battery does is it brings Enphase's modular microinverter technology to a whole new application. So that's energy storage. So each of these batteries uh, has a microinverter in it working with battery chemistry. Uh, it's super safe uh, lithium iron phosphate. Lithium ferrous phosphate. That's right. That's oh, ouch, another word for it, lithium ferrous phosphate, uh, that then can be used to store the energy from the sun for use when it's actually needed in the home. And it's really that simple. Is there anyone else making an AC battery out there? No, I think we're the only AC battery. Uh, now, of course, the battery itself is DC. But because of our technology, all of the wiring, everything the installer needs to work with, is actually all AC, which makes for a very simple installation. And also safe. And also safe. Right. So, and I, as I understand, the AC battery, uh, you have an announcement tomorrow for the AC battery? Something's going to start? So, we're actually going to be taking purchase orders from distributors starting tomorrow for the AC battery for North America, for the U.S. And that'll be for delivery in Q1. So next time we talk, there's going to be tons of these installed all over the place. That's great. Now, as I understand, they've already been launched in Australia. That's right. We're generally available in Australia and now bringing this to the U.S. Great. So let's talk a little bit about this larger system, the inter uh, the Enphase Home Energy Solution. Uh, I understand there have been some improvements made since we talked last summer. Well, uh, one of the improvements we've made is really focusing on how we integrate storage into our overall energy management system, our, our home energy solution. And uh, I can actually walk you through how that works. Great. Okay, so uh, just as with the microinverters, each of these batteries is communicating over the power line to the Envoy. But now that Envoy gateway, which is right over here, uh, it includes consumption and production metering. And previously, we were using that to show homeowners what's going on in their home from really just an understanding their energy perspective. Now, that consumption and production measurement is used to drive the battery behavior. And so that helps us determine when to charge, when to discharge. Uh, and it's also programmable. So what's new is if there's a time of use rate in effect, for example, the installer putting in the system can configure the battery so that it's only going to discharge when energy is the most expensive. So we've got uh, a simulated PV because we couldn't get the sun to shine in the conference center. But the storage itself is real. Uh, the metering is, is happening. And I can show you live what happens as the load changes in a home. And this will give you a sense of what's going on completely automatic and transparent energy management. So here we go. Uh, what you see right now is this blue line is the solar generation, okay? And the consumption is here, this orange and a certain small amount of draw from the grid. And this green line is the storage. And what you're seeing is pretty much everything that's being generated on the roof is going into the battery because there's no demand for energy in the home. But if I start upping the load, so let's just turn on our light. Okay, so now you're going to see that the load in the home is going up because I just turned on a pretty big and inefficient light bulb there. Uh, and so watch what's happening with the lines in terms of consumption and production. Because as they come close, if I increase the load, when they cross, the battery is going to flip from charging, and there you just saw it, now it's discharging. So the stored energy is using, being used to offset that consumption. And so that's, that's the greener, more efficient energy from solar that's now being used to power the home. Right, and I understand down here you can show us uh, a little bit more about the home energy use. 
at Enphase, we really focus on trying to provide a differentiated monitoring solution for the homeowner. Because what might make sense to you or most of us as energy professionals can be really overwhelming and not mean a whole lot. So uh, we really work to integrate storage into this view. And what you can see here, roll up a little bit. So this is kind of what you're used to seeing is just what's going on, total production and consumption. And then what we've added here is you can see how things are working throughout the day. So at night, you know, if the battery is fully discharged, you're just seeing normal consumption. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll through the day and talk you through what's happening in the home and you'll see it happening on screen. All right. So what you can see is as the sun starts to come up, you're starting to see some of the energy coming from solar. And then as folks leave for the day, there's and the sun, you know, there's more sun shining effectively on those solar panels. You can see again that all of that solar energy is is actually any excess that's not actually being used by the base load in the home is just getting stored in the battery, right? And and what this curve, dark blue curve, shows you that's all the excess solar that otherwise would just get exported to the grid, right? So instead, it's getting saved in the battery. And what you can see is as the battery continues to charge throughout the day. It gets 100% charged, and then in the evening, it's consumption spikes, like an electric oven comes on and uh, need a whole lot more energy. And maybe that's your peak time of use, you know, your peak time uh, where energy is more expensive. You're actually drawing that from the battery instead of just from the grid. And it's really that simple for homeowners, right? It's, it's about, I'm generating solar energy. I invested in this power plant for my house. So how do I use as much of that energy as possible? And so we try to make that really clear to see so they can understand what's going on with their investment in clean energy. Great. Len, thank you so much for taking the time to tell us about this. And congratulations on the uh, beginning of orders for the AC battery system. Thank you. We're very excited. And this is Christian Rosalind with PV Magazine Live. We're here at the Solar Power International Trade Show in Las Vegas.